So today I'm going to share my experience when troubleshooting cannot connect to the network using the LAN or Ethernet cable connection. So I have uh, my laptop and my PC here. This is IFI set here. This is the my laptop, and I cannot connect there. So the basic troubleshooting will be going to the control panel, type control in run command and hit OK then hit this network and internet here and you may also want to check your cable connection to see it is connected or not let's say identify means the cable is already connected that's ok and when this unidentified network status say it doesn't matter it will not affect your network connection you can still share files even the status is unidentified network so I'm just gonna close that now click this change advanced sharing settings and click the drop down and turn on network discovery to all the profile of course all networks to turn on sharing and just turn off the password in many cases you don't want this password to be turned on every time you want to connect to a PC or a network okay this IP set here is the computer computer one from uh, my laptop but I am now using the PC but my computer is not showing here so here's how to fix it to show the hidden or the unlisted computer from a network what you have to do is open the task manager and go to service uh, service is open and find this service called there function discovery resource publication and start the service you may also want to make it automatic but I'm just gonna leave it for now let's start let's see what happened and data my computer is now showing it is listed in the networks so this DVS PC this is the computer that I am using now and then this IV set here is my laptop is my network let's open it oops seems like a trouble occurs again it says 0x 800 735 oh, no, uh, uh, uh. Hmm. so if you find this kind of trouble this error all you have to do is just to open the local policy group editor type gvedit.msg here in the run command now the local group policy editor is showing click here the administrative templates and then network expand it and choose landman workstation I'm just gonna resize it first and then double click here to open this enable insecured guest logons choose this enabled option and click apply then ok let's just close this local group policy editor and now this is the moment of truth I'm going to open this IP set which is previously error occurs there cannot connect to the network now let's open it again and yep as you can see here I can access the network now the folder and file sharing is accessible so if you found this kind of trouble cannot connect to the Ethernet LAN or cable connection that is how to troubleshoot it it's not very hard isn't it so thank you very much for watching I hope you found that this video is useful to you See you in the next video.